So guys, good morning and welcome back to a new video. It's uh, been a long time and uh, as probably many of you know, it's been happening quite a lot last month or after month why it's been happening quite a lot. That was my uh, last race for uh, Smaction Gus Gus. Last race for uh, the Austrian brand. Was really exciting to leave Mantua. Still didn't knew exactly what I was going to do because was still a little bit unsure. But uh, yeah, we figured it out, and I think in the end it uh, has turned out really good, and I'm really excited for next year. So uh, yeah, for those of you that don't follow my Instagram and don't know, I'm going to ride for the FNH Kawasaki team. FNH uh, Kawasaki racing team or uh, what the name is and uh, yeah they are Netherlands based so that's nice to Duck. it's nice to get a little bit different experience than Italy it's been really good in XM action but uh, always when you move team and always when you move uh, country it's a little bit different experience how people are and stuff so I'm really excited for it it's going to be exciting to ride the Kawasaki I uh, had some uh, days on the bike and it feels really good already so I'm li really looking forward to it I think it's a bike that suits me well and uh, I've uh, enjoyed riding it so now I think my eggs are finished so you can watch some clips while I prepare them As you probably know, if you follow my Instagram and follow uh, all my social uh, media except YouTube because I've been really quiet there. I've been in Netherlands now for one month, I'm just back for Christmas holidays. And yeah, I didn't really get any time to make any videos there, I wanted to get to know all the team and uh, yeah, we did a lot of testing and also with a brand new bike for me. and new trainer and new people, new mechanics, everything new, so didn't want to film too much. Uh, yeah, that was really not on my mind, like I was focused on what we were doing and not about filming, but hopefully when we get to, to the pre-season I'm able to film a little bit and uh, make something happen for you guys and uh, at least now when I'm home making a small update video for you. I got a lot of questions if I would stop doing uh, videos and uh, no I won't, I will always keep uh, making YouTube videos, maybe it will change a little bit, maybe it won't be the same but for sure I will make something, I uh, really enjoy editing and all this stuff so it's just been a lot of things going on so didn't really have time for it but uh, this is one of my passions outside motocross of course motocross and training comes always first but videos and making videos and uh, getting new equipment and all these things are uh, really interesting for me and it's one of my passions so for sure I won't stop doing it So bro with the Liverpool stay Liverpool stay No idea what that's in English what is uh, Liverpool style in uh, English, Mia? Oh. Now let's uh, relax, watch some TV and then uh, eat. And now it's time for some cycling, some swift 
my old bicycle on the roller my new bicycle i don't want to damage it and also it's in netherlands so stuck on the old one the old nakamura nakamura never failed on me i'm rolling on it on the roller so let's do a swift session now Now, got in uh, a shower, got some food in my belly, and uh, it's time for some Call of Duty, some uh, PlayStation gaming. Still haven't got the uh, PlayStation 5 yet. Enjoying some uh, grapes. So, today uh, we uh, visited FF roller skis and uh, delivered some of my old ones and uh, picked up some uh, brand new ones and uh, I think that's really good training for motocross I want to say a big thank you, thank you to you and uh, maybe you want to explain a little bit what is good about these skis and uh, yeah, how I can use it best for my training yeah, yeah first of all thank you for using our skis it's really cool um... We hope you have a lot of success in both motorsport and uh, cross country. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> for this uh, uh, skis, uh, for classic, it's uh, the V shape in the wheel that make it very special because it's uh, it's like you're having uh, your um, uh, regular snow ski uh, tracks yeah. out on the asphalt. So then this, it's more stable. Yeah, it's yeah. more stable. It, it, it's easier to. To, uh, to, uh, to drive the ski and also to uh, when you double when you double 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 the classic ski yeah sorry I was just <laughs> didn't find the word but uh, anyway it's a very good classic ski and it has also a suspension for um, uh, bad asphalt so you don't get these vibrations from uh, from the bad asphalt into your legs and uh, muscles because uh, this is an, that's another that's the wrong training. Yeah, you need to have the correct training, and that's not with the vibration. Uh, yeah. Uh, so without the vibration, I'm more ready for the motocross the next day. Yes, yes, yes. yes I will say so. And um, for uh, the skate ski, uh, we have the same uh, uh, also with the suspension, and uh, we have also now producing the Norwegian wheels. Uh, so yeah, that's cool. Yeah, it's really cool, and the have the la laser, laser grade. <laughs> Kevin Argo here, so that's a really cool, cool touch. It's uh, important to get to this personal touch for sure. You can read more about our skis at uh, ffskis.com. Yeah, I will put the link there, and yeah. so the, the viewers can watch it. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Perfect. So just visited the uh, FF skis and. Uh, picked up some roller skis that I will use when I'm in uh, Holland and maybe in Italy for the preseason. So uh, big thanks to them and uh, yeah it's good training to, to for the motocross to do a little bit of skiing. It's not as uh, tough on the body like running and it's really good training and a little bit different than cycling all the time. So I really enjoy it and it uh, will be fun with the skating skis as well to do something different than only classic skis and uh, it's a little bit faster so we'll enjoy training that's for sure so big thanks and uh, yeah you should definitely check them out as well i think it's uh, really cool for everyone interested in skiing and getting fitter for motocross so then on the way back and uh, since yeah i got some uh, skate roller skis i also need to fix some skate uh, boots or ski boots because I don't have that I never really used skate so uh, it's fun to do something else and yeah just going to head to the local skiing shop now and uh, see what I get and we used a uh, little bit of money again we love to do that spend money so this is the new shoes 
skate shoes, boots, shoes, I don't know. Ski, skate, boots. She's the way. She's the way. Yeah. Nigorn sport day in Omot, so uh, yeah, perfect. So today's uh, stuff, we got the drinking belt here. That's perfect. Nice looking t-shirts. Especially this one, that is uh, orange, bright orange is good for when uh, out in the road, it's good to be seen. Yeah, this is quite sick with the name everywhere. And uh, yeah, this is the skate skis, which I bought uh, the skate shoes to fit. Salmon. Hope they are good. And then we got the classic skis here. With the yeah, this is like the speciality from them. This type of wheel. And yeah, my uh, name here. So really sick. And uh, once again, big thanks to FF Roller skis. And also I got these sick uh, glasses. So uh, now I'm ready to go out for some skiing when I arrive back in uh, Holland and uh, and Italy. In Holland now it's probably not so good weather, but uh, in Italy for sure it is. So I want to wish everyone a happy new year and uh, let's go into 22 with a bang. So big thanks to everyone and I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. And then we will continue with the videos a little bit more from now on. That's my New Year, what is it called? That is my uh, new torch for chat, so I don't know what is in English. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you, bye.